Of course, a little extra content here, guys, to help you guys out. Ryan Erdocker with LawAbidingBiker.com. We're in the middle of a starter project, and we're replacing a starter clutch. Just wanted to show you guys, um, you know, our four purchase video. If you want to know how to get the starter, replace the starter clutch. If you're getting that, you know, uh, winding sound, and your bike won't start. Yes. Uh, means your starter clutch has gone bad. You can head over to lawabidingbiker.com slash Harley Starter at any time. There's a video and information over there. Get your starter replaced, save yourself some money. Don't pay a dealership to do it. We removed the oil tank on this bike and everything. If you're watching the four purchase video already, um, you do not have to do this for the starter project that we're doing. This is an 07 and on, of course, about uh, anything with the 2006 and on Harley-Davidson motorcycles you don't need to actually remove any of the primary. What we've done here is just taken for visual purposes only. For this particular project, you don't need to do this. We already had the oil drained. We took the outer primary cover off, of course, all the bolts around. There's a gasket here that we're gonna replace. We were doing a fluid change anyways at the same time, so we wanted to take it off only for uh, visual purposes for you guys. So we've got our new starter in, of course, in this project and uh, we've already replaced that starter clutch. We kind of wanted to show you guys, you know, you got the clutch, the primary chain generally, the sprockets, all that kind of stuff, your tension shoe down here. That's generally what it looks like, um, but we want to show you guys how the starter, once it's basically uh, fixed and it's working appropriately, kind of how it works. This is your starter wheel right here, um, is what they call it. Starter ring gear. S starter ring gear, if you want to be completely appropriate. Um, that's what that is, and that's actually what your starter here. And Lurch is on the other side, he's working some wires, we're just giving the, the starter some direct power, but basically what happens is, this pops out, your solenoid pops the starter out, it engages, it's got the clutch in there, so it comes in real nice and aligns the gears, it all happens really quick, and then, of course, the clutch engages and it spins, and it spins your motor, thus firing the bike. Of course, our run switch isn't on. We're doing real quick bumps here just to show you guys. So the first thing we're gonna demonstrate is he's only gonna put power to the switch. Um, and that's all, he's not gonna put power to actually turn the starter. Uh, he's just doing power on the other side. And in our video, we show you how to do this, put it on a workbench and actually test all this stuff. So he's gonna give it power and we're just gonna watch the solenoid pop out and see how that works. So here we go. So you can see it popped out. And the reason it didn't pop in is because we're actually not spinning it. When it's actually spinning and turning the bike, as soon as it's done and it's turning, it will pop back in on its own. Um, that's just because it wasn't actually turning. So now this time, he's actually gonna put power to both the switch for the solenoid and he's gonna put power to actually turn it. We're gonna turn the motor a little bit. Of course, it's not on run, guys. It's in neutral, all the safety. I'm actually gonna reach up and grab the clutch just for safety and he's gonna do the whole thing now. Here we go. So there you go. That's how that works, guys, and it just turns your motor. That was just a quick bump. That's a little look inside again for the starter project we're doing. You don't have to do any of this. This was just for visual purposes. If you're not subscribed to this YouTube channel, you are really missing out. We have a ton of videos in the works for you guys, so get subscribed. Also sign up for the free email club, lawabidingbiker.com slash email club. We will shoot you an email when we come out with new free videos. Also, do not forget to check out that weekly podcast. It's the Law Abiding Biker Podcast. It's heard worldwide. All right, peace out.